And it took a true grassroots effort of going around and pulling out um, data, showing, showing how the horse industry impacts all the counties that are out there. Uh, not, not just two or three here in central Kentucky, but, you know, we had, we had videos, we had testimony from people way out in Western Kentucky that are selling hay and straw into the industry. Um, and, and we have owners, uh, people who'd invested into the industry, but live, you know, as far West as Paducah and far, far East as Ashland. It covers the entire state, uh, not to mention things like the economic impact of, I think we're a $6.6 .6 billion industry in the state of Kentucky and HHR alone, um, $22 million impact to the general, to the general fund. I don't know anybody that can tell you we can, that says we can afford to lose money out of the general fund right now. So we just had the grassroots effort showing them how much the horse business meant. So tugging on the hard, hard strings a little bit, and then the numbers, just showing them the numbers. Cause that, that's where it needs, that's where our decisions really need to be showing the numbers, um, and what's, what's going on with the industry and why it's so important. And you can say little things like Oaks and Derby Day alone in 2019, $385 million economic impact in two days. Right, right, of course. What, what, are, their industry, what are their industries throwing, throwing those kind of numbers around? No, and we're, we're a premier industry. We got to protect it.